Good morning, beautifuls. It is Thursday, June 13th. There's rocket planes up in the sky. <laughs> it's like 10 30, 17 degrees. There's a train. You know, the use. <laughs> I come out to do a vlog and the wind picks up and the train comes. Whatever. I really, I don't care. I don't think we can see it from up here anyway. Yeah, I know the trees are all grown in. Can't see the train. You sure hear it though. It sounds like it's urgent. Ah, I love the train. It sounds really loud, like even the warning bells. Good morning as I'm standing here picking my nose. Allergy season is upon me. So here we are, it's Thursday. Feeling so good after dance class last night. I'm so grateful for that. I love it's midweek. It just, it picks me up. It gets me going to the end of the week. It's a beautiful day today. The sun is shining. Oh, the birds are singing. People are doing yard work. I'm feeling productive. I'm actually literally editing my video right now for tomorrow for the main... Excuse me, I'm talking for the main channel. So we have a railroad crossing a mile that way. And we have two in town, just that, like, literally two, one a block away from the other. So that's why we have so many whistles. Like, I can hear the one from down there. I've got, like, 40 seconds, 45 seconds. The one from over there, if it's the first one, I've got about 38 seconds. Second one, I'm not running for it. So, <laughs> and I can make it down the block to the railroad tracks if I'm armed and ready to go. So I am grateful for dance. Was I just talking about that? Because that's what I'm grateful for. It gives me the energy to keep going. I'm grateful for my vitamin regime. Um, I know I don't talk a lot about it, but vitamin Bs help keep me elevated. Um, they help me with energy. They help me with mood. They help me with lots of other things. So I love, love, love taking my vitamin Bs. Um, and when I take them before class, it just helps my muscles, right? So I do this dance so that I can feel stronger and fitter and more flexible. It's not about my size or anything like that or how much I weigh. So I'm really grateful that I get to go and like be strong with my body, which leaves me feeling good for the rest of the week. So that, that's how that one ties in. And hello, it's beautiful. Yes, we took the chicks out yesterday, <laughs> and um, they are adapting well to the new location, but the ladies are not. They're not happy about it. All right, I wasn't going to do this. So if you're here for the moment of beauty and the moment of gratitude, there it was. Let's go find out why I get dressed in the mornings. Ah, chickens! So, <laughs> walking, walking, walking. We'll just spy on these guys, see what's up. Oh, the big girls are out. Let's go get them some flowers. Because they're so attractive. Hold on. Okay, I got a handful. We're just gonna toss to the big girls to get them all distracted. Right, big girls, I see you up there. Back up, back up, back up. Good morning, chickens. Good morning, big girls. Look at what I have. What's this? What's this? Fetch. Go get the big stuff. Run for it. Go for it. Stop grumbling about the babies. Okay, let's go see those babies. Go, I just fed you guys. Again. Round two. So it's really low light, but <laughs> hey, 
baby chickens. So that's the little spot. They've got a crate. I sprinkled food in there for them today because the big girls came and started at their dish right away. Right, big girl? Don't be mean. And then hubby put the step there for the watering thing. And uh, one of the babies has jumped up on there and he's figured it out. Nothing has changed with your stuff. Go outside and be a chicken. She still has her egg over there. So, yeah, they're doing good. Oh, they're so cute. This one here. Here. Oh, stop. It likes it when I pet it. This one comes up to me all the time, so it's probably a boy. Likes to be pet. I know it doesn't seem like it, but they'll come over. See? You want to come get pets? The big girl's like, oh, you can't see. The big girl's like getting pets, too, but they'll never say they do. Yep, cute little things. So there we are, our little moment of beauty. Ooh, something else really cool is I saw a snake in the, there's a snake in my boot. No, <laughs> a snake in the sticks. So hopefully that means it's well fed. It looked like a big one. And um, Manitoba is home to three different types of garter snakes and they're not poisonous. They may think they're rough and tough, but they are not poisonous. And uh, so it was in here. It was, hmm, it was long. About that, about that fat. So they're not dangerous. They're not poisonous. They're pretty cool. They help keep rodents and stuff away. So I'm excited about that. I like catching them when they're sunning in the garden. They're, they look so cute. So, yep, there we go. We got snakes. We got chickens. We got birds. We got flowers. We got fairy gardens. There's so many reasons to be grateful and so many beautiful things to look at. So, there we go. Back to the garden we are. I love you guys, and thanks so much for hanging out here with me, celebrating the beauty. 365 days of gratitude. All right, I will see you again tomorrow. Mwah. Bye.